Ugh. All right, so as you guys know, Super Smash Brothers has been out for one whole day on the Wii U. Got some questions about the Amiibos, got some questions about whole difficulty, and also got some questions about online. Okay, so let's hop right into this. This is going to be just a quick tip, guys. I'm, I'm still going to keep doing this on Twitch, and you're just going to do this post, and... There might be a link in the description if I fair game. No, it's just gonna be on the main video on my homepage. Okay, now with the amiibo, I'm gonna do this first. Because that was the first question I saw when I started to do this yesterday. Um, you can only do the amiibo so far in just these, um, modes. Because online, they might do, I heard something about they might do something with Amiibos online in the future, but not now. So, yeah, so if you're planning to get your Amiibo online, um, don't help it. Like, just yet. Because, if I, because, I don't, I don't know why, it's a third decision, so, I don't know. Okay, and since we're on the topic of Amiibo, yeah. Amiibo. I was actually actually going to on in my Twitch videos, and they actually told me I'm actually all the way leveled up and I'm like, what? No, I'm not. But it turns out I actually am. Because, uh, I got my YouTube video before you get started. Yoshi! Yoshi! There you go, buddy. Yeah, anyway. Yeah. So I'm actually at my maximum level now. <laughs> and then you have this and then you did this one with my new So tips to get your amiibo leveled up quickly, I guess, um, the way I did it, I guess this is getting more stuff. Yeah, hey dude. What's the point of having or something if we can't do anything with it? But anyway, I, I guess the whole point of, because I did a player smash. And I had him do and I had him battling level 9 on computer which was also me, so I guess with the computer also on level 9, I was on a hard difficulty. Maybe he learned fast or maybe my amiibo is just very smooth. I don't know. But um when I'm on this topic, I wanna have some questions for you guys. Do any of you guys know how to get your amiibo to learn new moves? Because I have fully leveled up, but he has not learned one new move at all. And I don't know how to do that. So if you guys know, please let me know. <laughs> if you guys know, let me know. So yeah, that's a new um some tips. Okay, now back to the characters. I'm sure pretty much all of you guys can go this for just the first match. Um set it on if you if you don't have the game if you're looking to just unlock the character, you know, so you could just play a like, with your friends online of who you want to be. Um, and if it's not the meeting, you can't make the meeting all that. Um, just, just click this. And put it on... Put it on survival and one stock and just keep gearing up the edge. And you also finish it also, um, with the 3DS stuff, that, that's the big one involved, because with that, I go back to Mario. No, I didn't click it. Okay, but I actually did 3DS, 3DS transport, I didn't think it, I didn't think it transport, but, uh, I don't even post it. But there you go, see, this is my Mario, and there's a different album, different label. 
I did not, I, I did not unlock any more moves, but since I transformed them from the 3DS version. So my advice to you guys is, if, if, if you know, if you can't play, um, the Wii U, you may can do it on one television. And the game had reached not that far away, and if you have the 3DS version. My advice for you is, take that character, do Smash, and keep unlocking stuff, um, for the 3DS version. And customize that character, and then send them over here. That's what I did. Same with my, um, my Yoshi. No way not. It's Battle Junior! My Yoshi, see, I got enough for work. There's the only two I got really major, really got stuff for in the, um, in the, the Death Potion. Everyone else is still working on. But yeah, I just say do that. Because in here, I don't know how to unlock the, the move. I, you know, besides it just being locked. But yeah, but anyway, with you doing the 100 matches in the locker field, you also do something a huge favor of getting into this mode later. Which is classic mode. Classic mode, go over there. Just a single player. And, uh, I don't know, I can't think. Yeah, so why not? Because, see how you need money? To, to echo this, to enter level 9, please. Well, the way that you get the reason I had this opportunity as soon as I started this, because I did all of these battles, and even though I lost the battles, I, I, still, get, I still got all these coins, so um, I didn't do um, level 9 the first time, you know. But, but every time I go to level 9, and every time I'm going to get to that, Master Hand, there's more combination, there's more um, transformations that you guys probably saw on my yesterday video cover. Did you see this? Because uh, I mean that's great. Um, to it, to it, to make it more dramatic. Yeah, but I did be on level 9. I think I beat it on, on level 8, something like that, or 11, 7.9. Because, because every time when you be on high level, you get a ton of cash, so you'll be able to do this all the time. That's my recommendation to you. Always check level 9 so you can get a ton of cash and you're not low on it. So you can do all of your, all of your characters on level 9. Because cause I think it's fun if you find them the master hand information and all that. Um, yeah. Make sure you do that. Um, master orders and crazy orders. Um, I guess see, I really don't, I really have not play this one as much. The only thing that I can say since Crazy is the older is super expensive. You might want to play Master Order just to get a pass for Crazy Orders before you do his. Because his is really expensive. And it's not worth it. And it's like not worth that one. You can always get a pass here easily. So yeah just do Master Order to get a pass for the Crazy Orders. And then just hope you win, that's all I can say. With Crazy Orders me. And then, you know, this is just like the common contest and all that stuff. This is just basic stuff. That really does not matter, you know, the multi man guys, the training and all that. But yeah, that stuff really does not interest me. And here's like where you can create your character on the Wii U. Um, and here is the stage slot. Stage bro. I like how you can draw them. Too bad I'm not a good draw. Like, just look at this one that I made. It's just all rocks. See this one, and it's super hard to do. So yeah, um, if you're talented, that's good for you. But if you're not, oh, another thing that I want to do mention to you: if you do not have an external hard drive yet for some reason, with the Wii U or the Smash Brothers, you know, just in case it's like your first console, or if you never had the need to get one. You might want one for this because you cannot save on this because only a hard drive for now, I think. They might they might patch it for um uh you know other things, but who you knows? But and the last thing, this I I have never done. Why? Because um to me this just looks boring. I. Anyone who likes that, good, good for you, you entertainers, but you like this, but 
I, I, I could not get through one round. I just got so bored of this because it gets, it's just like if I wanted to play my party, I wanted to play my boy, and you have to do a so amount of tunes too, so it's not like you can just start to battle like right now, like with Master or with Crazy or not. And, and also, so far, um, I haven't get, gotten anyone over yet, you know, to um, try it, so may, maybe, maybe it would be more fun with four other people when they but if you're just doing this like for five yourself, you not do it. Okay, other thing, and this is for the 3DS chance for, it's very basic. If you, if you have the 3DS version, you just turn on a card on the Wii U and then they will instantly connect. I'm not going to do all that because it's just a waste of time and one thing to check off, so pretty much every question could be answered. I mean, every, yeah, all my questions they got. Come on, loot. Is this online motion? For now. Now, I'm gonna create a room and see if, if I could use my amiibo. I'm pretty sure you can, but let me just, let me just see if I, if I create my own room. Okay. I do not think he, yeah, I don't, I do not think Amiibo is allowed online yet. Oh, I think somebody might have been, no, well, no, no one was going, no one's online, I think. Oh, wait, no, a ton of people are online, never mind. Oh, that's a strike game, yeah. No. Oh, yeah, they brought that back. I don't think it was in the CDS version. And this is just... Oh, isn't, isn't this just two you your favorite to win? Okay, whatever. Yeah, that doesn't matter. Anyway, so yeah. um, That is... Yeah, so you cannot pick your Amiibo online yet they might they might like but no the whole online is still not finished so supposed to be doing this online tournament you know that you can invite people to and I heard it's gonna hold up to 50 people in one tournament so maybe they can come up with the dogs that have to use on me but online but other than that you can't for now that's what I'm gonna say I'm not gonna say that like you can but now just one last thing to do. Now. Level nine. What is my level fifteen music? <laughs> Let me just do a basic one like this. 
Alright. One Yoshi Amiibo and then I'll end the video. Oh, yeah, I didn't even have one stock too. Oh, it won't be a long battle. Oh, no, my Amiibo! So, I guess you got the clock. When there are no items on, the Amiibo is unbeatable. <laughs> I think ever since he got to level 49, he has never lost against the level 9, so I wasn't gonna put extra three people on there. Yeah, so that's that's uh my tips for you guys to see the Smash Brothers if you do not have the game or if you're planning to get the game. Well if you do have the game and you're trying to figure out how to unlock everything. The only thing that I do not know for sure is how to, exactly how to unlock all of the codes. Like all the stages to choose from. I heard... Nah, I don't want to... Nah, I just think it's because I don't need to do that. I heard, um... Game explains things only about you have to do, um... Like, certain missions and certain thing, things like that and that... Uh, Look at what it's called. It's, it's, it's that one mode like when you just do missions. That thingy. And I'm being so specific, but if you guys know, you guys might know. Or you could just probably, oh, you might just unlock them by doing a couple matches of and different things online. Um, all that fun stuff. Because I never done with them all unlocked because I even just went online by putting on clothes that I have never seen before, so. Yeah, so thank you guys for um, watching this um, tips for Smash Brothers. We knew that I'm gonna pack it in my channel. Everything of what I said down there. Long title. And I will see you guys if you guys are gonna be joining me on Twitch in probably 20 minutes. See you guys then.